the vibration um, um reading for the Leo Sun Moon and Rising sign I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back it has been a wonderful time and uh, please listen to your Sun Moon and Rising sign it is the last week of October and the week begin from the 23rd until the 29 whatever the situation is happening in this week it's going to be good money 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 is going to come in Monday is a very good day for you. Tuesday, you have the Six of Pentacles. So that means that you'll be given or receiving money. In this week, you have the energy of the Queen of Swords. So a lot of you Leos are going to be connecting or having situations or you yourself are going to be having the energy of the Queen of um, Sword. So be aware and be careful of what you do and what you say. On Thursday is a wonderful day for you because your financial situation will be in balance. Money is coming in to you. On Friday, you have a water sign. You have a day of intuition. Your guides and angels are coming in and it's going to advise you via your intuition on what to do, what situation, how can you resolve certain situation in your life. On Saturday, you have another pentacle set energy, which is good because this week is a week of fire and water so there's a lot of balance and on Sunday you have uh, the energy of uh, the four of cups boredom okay so let's look and see what is going to be taking place there is a situation that an organization you're going to be victorious in whatever that has been happening the tower is going to break down because the universal angels and guides are going to come in to remove whatever that was blocking you so let's look on Monday and first um, your best day is going to be on a Monday okay victory and success that and you are going to be moving on from a situation or people that no longer serves you your own energy vibration is here um, on Saturday so that is good especially for the man for you men you'll be working with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn okay um, let's look at what is happening in your numerological numbers because you have six and ten you have eight twice you know six and seven so um, and you have the number eight so whatever is happening um, there are situations that are happening and you seem to be because the tower is 16 6 and 1 is 7 so you have 7 twice so let's look you have 7 3 times 3 times 7 on Monday you have the 8 of 1 so messages will be coming in to you whatever you were hoping and dreaming and wishing for this message is is going to be coming in to you so this is very good this is very positive um, the seven of cups is always your wishes you're dreaming and you, um, you know your thoughts are going out but this is going to be good for business if you're looking for a job on Monday you will receive good news on Tuesday you have a heard sign and some of you will be giving uh, away little gifts or receiving little gifts uh, and this is a, a, a sense of receiving because you'll be receiving little gifts from an organization so maybe an organization realized that you've paid too much and they're going to return it to you okay and um, it can be that you have to pay back something to an organization um, the, your week is a week of new beginnings for a lot of people and you have the energy of the fool so you're victoriously successful in something and you're starting on a new beginning and this is going to be very powerful it is sorry the energy for the week I don't want to sneeze <laughs> sorry <laughs> and um, this is the energy of the week and this is going to be positive whatever the situation that is happening in your life whatever that you have overcome it's going to be good because you're starting a new beginning this is a positive for a lot of people in this week this is good a air sign now we have another Pentacles the nine of Pentacles this is wonderful on Thursday you're going to receive news about your financial abundance whatsoever that was blocking your financial abundance now it is coming to an end um, whatever that uh, the eight of swords that you weren't seeing that was blocking your financial abundance now you're seeing things much clearer 
on friday the eye princess comes in and whatever the eye princess is always your angels and guides come in to remove something that no longer serves you so this is friday is a day of releasing for you so it's mental anguish for some people releasing you and showing you to have self-confidence in yourself removing the blockages removing people that no longer serve you that sort of energy is coming in on friday and this is going to be positive on Sunday you have your own selves but you have also the knight of Pentacles coming towards you so for you men whatever is happening you could be paying back the knight of Pentacles or the knight of Pentacles is bringing you money so it's gonna happen for different people in different ways but this is someone who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn as we move forward we have double fours which is good another um, double you're feeling boredom on a Sunday but you know um, I don't feel boredom because what is happening is that you need to find time whenever you're bored that is the time you start to dream and this is good because in the time of boredom you start to dream and that's why you I end up being victorious in this week and starting to think about new beginnings and most of you will be going on new beginnings so the number four number four to four is going to be your energy vibration for this week whatever is happening in the first half of the week uh, you there is a situation with the organization either you have to pay some people maybe have to pay back a little amount of money or help out the organization or um, an organization have to pay you whatever is happening knight of Pentacles is here and also um, you you know you, you're dreaming and all these thoughts and ideas is coming up in your mind remember them write them down and you're going to see that you're going to survive this whatever is happening um, the eight of swords is you know that was there against your money is going to be released you're feeling boredom but yet still the universe is going to come in and break away whatever is happening and your money is going to start flowing so whatever the situation is in your life there is now a week of love it's more a week of you connecting with yourself you healing yourself you um, you know trying to release a certain um, situation certain aspect of yourself and it's going to work out perfectly for you guys I'm using the energy of the unicorn so let's look and see what is the energy of the unicorns would like to bring out for the Leos and it says uh, act on your purpose today act on your purpose today so this is a good one whatever is happening act on your purpose that means uh, go for what you want whatever you have been dreaming for whatever whoever you want it to be go for it because it's going to happen for you in this week it's a fire week uh, and we have live wire whenever the energy of life wire comes up is that exactly what you think uh, the universe will take it to you exactly what you want the universe will take it to you and it's going to be very positive so whatever the situation is whatever that has been coming up um, when live wire comes up that means you will receive that which you have asked the universe for within you is a powerful electricity that can change the world both your world and the world for other people scientists call it the elixir but you can think of it uh, as a super energy charger and this is good because uh, you know that you have the power to change whatever is happening within you and within your life so I want to say to each and every person out there please please enjoy your week and understand that love is the only thing that is real namaste please listen to your Sun Moon and Rising sign like and share these videos thumbs up until next week